Um, in the town Ron Paul has represented for decades, folks say voters in Iowa are discovering what they've known all along. That the doctor turned politician is a man of deeply held principles who believes he can help save our nation from harm. When it comes to Lake Jackson, Texas, three things leap to this reporter's mind. Dow Chemical, Bucky's, and U.S. Representative Ron Paul. And we've dug a hole for our party. We're losing elections and we're going down next year if we don't change it. And it has all to do with foreign policy and we have to wake up to this fact. While folks here are long accustomed to their maverick congressman running for president, they are less familiar with hearing the term front runner attached to this dedicated oracle of drastically downsizing America's government. He's a little, little wild on a few things, you know, but uh, in general, most of what he stands for, I like. That said, longtime Lake Jackson resident Jim Bertram believes it's high time more voters gave the 76-year-old Texan a serious look. And after this administration, I think they're more open to Ron Paul than they've ever been. Yeah, I think he's got, the, he's got a better chance than he's ever had, I think. Like many in Lake Jackson, Dr. Paul was Phyllis Bertram's obstetrician. And she says the well-liked great-grandfather has remained in the fight for all the right reasons. I think you can believe what he tells you. I don't think he will tell you something just to get elected. I think that's what keeps him going. I think he thinks he can do something good for the country. Bookseller Cecile Castillo has been following Paul for a quarter century and says his minimalist message has finally connected with an anxious nation's mood. Stay out of foreign wars and concentrate more on our own country. Political observers believe Ron Paul's Iowa surge is a consequence of the general dissatisfaction felt among Republicans for the rest of the GOP field. Tom? Greg, thank you.